How do you start a coffee shop business with zero dollars? And is it possible to start a coffee shop business with little to no money? Now, I definitely know the frustration you guys are going through because what you are doing right now is you're trying to gather up all the information that you can get so that you can make the best decision for yourself to become a better version of yourself so that you can be able to leave your nine to five job and finally start growing something that you can own and call as yours because here's the reality when you're working for a job it's never your company it's not yours and it will never be yours and that's the truth you will be working like mad just to get by just to be able to pay your bills just to be able to see another day and it shouldn't be like that you shouldn't have to struggle trying to grow yourself a business of trying to grow yourself a coffee shop business and i am here today to eradicate all of the problems eradicate all of the incomplete information so that you can be able to soon leave your nine to five job and start growing your coffee shop business but first, before we begin, I believe that you guys need to have more understanding of why there is a lot of incomplete information and why it seems that nobody is there to show you the process of how to start your coffee shop business and also why colleges don't offer these kind of courses for entrepreneurs. Well, first, you guys have to understand that the people that are telling you how to start a coffee shop business most of the times don't have any experience of growing a coffee shop. Most of the times they are just pretenders acting as if they know what they're talking about. But in reality, they have no idea of what goes behind creating a business. If you were to look deeply into their YouTube channels, for example, or if you were to look at their website, you will realize that they have content about various subjects. So they're not concrete on one subject. A person that's not concrete on one subject doesn't have enough experience or knowledge to give you to make the right decisions. If you were to look at my YouTube channel, for example, all we talk about is how to grow a coffee shop, how to expand your coffee shop business, and all the strategies that you need to implement in order to grow your coffee shop effectively. And we make sure that this YouTube channel is dedicated towards entrepreneurs who are looking to grow their coffee shop successfully. Now, if you haven't subscribed, you can pause the video real quick and hit the subscribe button for more valuable content that will help you grow your coffee shop. When it comes to growing a coffee shop, it's not as simple as looking to see what available commercial property is there or just writing a business plan. You need to know who your competitors are and what they are offering, how good the quality they are offering, and you need to be able to position yourself to look more attractive to the customers so that they can leave their competitors and come to your store. In order to become a successful entrepreneur and a successful business person, you have to be willing to take calculated risks. And what I mean by calculated risk, I mean risk that is made in such a way that even if you were to fail, you don't lose much. We want you to put yourself in a position where if you were to make a big financial mistake, at least you don't lose everything that you've built and you can still be able to try again. And the reason why I decided to create the Coffee Shop Masterclass course for you guys is because I realized what you guys are seeking is not really to become millionaires. Your guys' goals is not to get rich. What you guys are looking for is just a way to be able to be financially independent and to leave your current job. And that is the goal. You don't have to have a goal where the goal is to make a million dollars. No, you don't have to have that much money. Now, if you obtain that one day through your business acumen, that's all the better. But you can just be fine by earning a quarter million dollars a year and earning $90,000 in profits from your coffee shop and live very comfortably. You don't have to be super big or the next Starbucks. You just need some source of income that is coming from somewhere so that you can be able to live your life and be able to travel and be able to take care of your family and be able to just be yourself and be able to give back to the community. If you are looking to start and grow your coffee shop and start earning your first quarter million dollars this year, I highly recommend you get the Coffee Shop Masterclass course. Links will be provided in the description below. The course will show you step by step how to grow a coffee shop with zero dollars. It will show you how to raise money from investors and banks, how to find the right location to house your coffee shop and more. Now, as a consequence, the course is over three hours long and it may not be as interesting and bubbly as you guys might want it to be. But as I was creating this course, I had to make a decision that I would rather you guys hear the truth rather than to sugarcoat it with bubbliness and motivational nonsense, because I would rather you guys have all the information you need and to hear the truth about how you should approach starting your coffee shop so that you can start making a change in your life for the better. So as a result, the course is over three hours long with invaluable information that you won't find anywhere else online. And because I've decided to focus more on adding value to the course rather than making it fun and interesting, you will start to see results immediately. Now, another question that needs to be answered is why don't they teach this in college? Why don't they have a course on how to grow your coffee shop from scratch? The reason why is because it's too niche and it won't make a lot of money for the colleges in the long term. See, college is a business in itself, so they're only going to provide courses that are more mainstream so that they can make the most money per student. 
And the worst kind of course that you want to take is to take business classes. It's too generic. You won't learn anything. You won't learn the reality of what it means to grow a business. Business is not a matter of supply and demand. That's too basic. You need to understand why people buy from others. You need to know why people spend money. You need to know why customers buy from your competitors and might be unlikely to buy from you. And the more you understand these reasons, the more you'll be able to position yourself to success by including what you've learned into practice. The problem why you may not be able to find this kind of information is because it's not something that's mainstream. People are going to tell you things that sounds good, but not the things that you need to hear so that you can make the right decisions. So let me give you an example of what you should know when it comes to growing a coffee shop. Why do you think customers go to coffee shops? Do you think they go there just to buy a coffee? Now, if that's the case, what's stopping them from getting their own Mr. Coffee so that they can make their own coffee from home? A Mr. Coffee maker only costs $20 on Amazon. A Folgers coffee ground only costs $7. And when you add sugar and creamer, that's roughly $3. And if you add all this together, it would only cost $30 to make coffee and your potential customers can make themselves coffee up to about 100 times. So then the question is, why would anybody in their right mind go to a coffee shop to buy a coffee for $5, $10 when they can simply just buy themselves one and make as much coffee as they want? Now, here's the kicker. This is the reason why I tell everyone that YouTube and Google is a double edged sword. And what I mean by a double edged sword is that it can help you. But at the same time, it can also hurt you. When you are researching online, you're going to hear that all you need to do is to write a business plan. All you need to do is have the great coffee and all you have to do is be passionate and consistent to a certain degree. Yes, it's true, but it's still missing something more. Here's the reality. People go to coffee shop not to get coffee. People go to coffee shop because they want the experience. They want to socialize with people. They want to socialize with the baristas. They like the interior design of the coffee shop. They want to take pictures of themselves in your coffee shop so that they can post on their Instagram. They want to conduct work activities and job interviews. They want to go on a date and the coffee shop facilitates that environment. Your coffee is only 25% of the reason why people come. Now, you might be kicking yourself thinking, how is that possible? You have to understand that human needs are very complex. Humans need water and humans need food. That's a very easy way to understand basic human needs. But once those needs have been met, any other needs after that will become more complex. Not only do people want to get coffee, but they also want to socialize with others. They want to feel a part of a group. They want you to have a nice interior design. They want you to have excellent customer service. And they also want you to save puppies at the same time. Now, if you do all of these things at the same time, then customers will have more reasons to come to your coffee shop. Not only do they want a tasty cup of coffee from your coffee shop, but they also want to know that by buying from you, their money is going to help the homeless. They want to know that the money is also going to charity so that when they are buying from you, they can also feel good about themselves. So what does this all mean? Well, this means that you want to create a business where people feel good about themselves after buying from you. This is where things get more complex because now you need to understand what are those needs that people want and how can you satisfy them all at the same time? It's not just the basics of needing water and food. Now, to keep this video short, I'm going to make another video on the step by step process of growing your coffee shop from the ground up. In the meantime, if you find this video helpful, I would like for you to hit the like button as this helps YouTube recommend this video to other coffee shop entrepreneurs. And if you haven't hit the subscribe button, click the subscribe button for more future content that is going to help you grow your coffee shop effortlessly. And if you're looking to start taking the action right now and start living your dreams as a coffee shop entrepreneur, Get the Coffee Shop Masterclass course today by visiting www.thecafeacademy.com.